United Five, a brand new defenders investigation with fears that our limited hospital and intensive care unit beds won't be enough in the coming weeks and months. The defenders Nathan Morabito discovered our local Veterans Affairs Medical Center confirms to us it's ready to help if civilian health care systems become overwhelmed. State records show hospitals in the Charlotte Metro like this one have a combined 600 plus ICU beds. Any other time enough to meet the need. But during a pandemic, likely not nearly enough. That's why every extra hospital bed is critical. There are thousands of us giving our best every day to heal millions of veterans. The VA has long prided itself on providing excellent service. As a healthcare system, the VA is way ahead of any other types of healthcare industries. Reserved specifically for our veterans. The most professional people who are there to serve us and give us the professional service that we deserve. But the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs also has what's described as a fourth mission to not just help veterans, but help everyone in a national emergency. We always like to work with the locals to make sure uh, that we're available should they need us. That commitment came into question recently as all mentions of the fourth mission disappeared from VHA's Office of Emergency Management website. While our local hospitals are not overwhelmed at this point, if it comes to that, Salisbury VA assured us it stands ready to support the department's fourth mission to surge capabilities into civilian health care systems in the event those systems encounter capacity issues. Not only does this VA medical center and the 150 others across the country have hospital beds, they have a limited number of ICU beds too. 13,000 acute care beds nationwide, 1,800 of them in ICU units. Every additional VA bed, one more that could become essential. In the event our hospitals are overrun, the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services would be the one to request the VA's help. Nathan Morabito, WCNC Charlotte.